I'm 43 now. Come the time the next election, I've, I would have spent 20 years in the Yorkness. It's a long time. And um, I certainly had no ambition uh, to be in politics all my life. I think it's not fair on your family. Uh, it's not fair on the public have to put up with you, I suspect, um, on your constituents. I also think this, we have a lot of new TDs. I think that politics is changing. I think you're going to find more and more people coming in for a, a short period of time rather than being there for 30 years. I certainly wouldn't want to be there for 30 years. I think there's... Um, okay, what about cabinet? Of course, any you know, any any any, particular any minister of state would. Um, I suppose the two areas that I've enjoyed most have been working on issues around the economy and education. I mean, the problem I, finance. Uh, well, yeah, I think finance would be something that I've certainly enjoyed working on. But um, I think education is something that's going to be really important with the growth of the country. And when I was there for three years, I really enjoyed that time as well. But like this is a matter entirely for the Taoiseach. Uh, it's up to him to appoint his ministers, and our job is to do the best job we can. And the other thing I say is this: it's an enormous privilege, and I really mean this. You know, to, to serve in government at a time, you know, when the economic, you know, in, in, in two or three decades, people will write books about this period of time uh, if we manage to get the country back on a sustainable economic footing, and that's a great privilege to be part of that.